space check windows down arrow shortcut keys dot hey everybody this is Keith here at KTB web services it is early in the morning here in Florida and I figured I would come to you with a quick video to show you how to see the um, word count as well as the character count in a Microsoft Word document so real quick I'm gonna come over here and now I'm using JAWS 2018 it's a little outdated but still relevant um, and then I'm going to turn this off and turn NVDA on and uh, NVDA screen reader on and show you with that screen reader so um, we are in our document here it's the shortcut keys I'm going to make a video on this here soon um, but what we want to do is let me go to the top level two using NVDA and, heading level two Microsoft. and you just you hear me reading it so I'm going to select all 20, 51 characters select. so there's 20 51 characters heading level one. so now with JAWS you can check you can do a JAWS key or insert three Page number, page one of three. Spelling and grammar check errors. Focus, zoom out, zoom in, zoom 100%. So it gives us our zoom and our uh, what our focus is, and then uh, if we have any spelling errors, and then um, page the number, page. amount of pages and what page we're on. So <clears throat> to check your word count, you want to press, <clears throat> sorry, F6. F6, status bar, tool bar. And you get a status bar, and we're just going to keep cycling through this so you can hear it. F6, upper ribbon, group box, F6, document pane, the ribbon, then we come to level one. our actual document. F6, status bar, tool bar. Okay, we're back in our status bar, so now we're going to read our current line, JAWS key up arrow. Land. And now I'm going to down arrow. Spelling and grammar check errors button. So check errors, down arrow. Focus button to act. Focus. Read mode tab. To Read mode. Read layout tab. Web layout tab. To zoom out button to activate. And I'm just down arrow. Zoom and button to activate. Zoom 100% button. To Let's see, we get our zoom. Page number, page one of three button. There's our page one of three, just like we just heard. Word count 337 words. Okay, we come to our word count 337 words. Spelling and and then our spelling and grammar check errors because we need to check. Word count 300. All right, so word count. We're going to press enter on this. Word count dialog. Word count. Word count. All right, so now I'm going to down arrow through this. Word count. Word count. Word count. Oh, okay. Now it's going to be different JAWS. I am a default NVDA oh. reader, but uh, we're going to you or NVDA user. Let's JAWS key this and <clears throat> up arrow and down arrow. Include text boxes, comma, footnotes, and endless. That was a down arrow. Close. Include text. I'm an up arrow. Lines 57. Okay, so now we're getting some information. Lines 57. Paragraphs 42. Paragraphs 42. Characters left paren with spaces right paren 1, comma, 973. All right, and there's our characters with spaces. And that was Eric characters left pair with spaces right pair in one comma nine seven three one nine so one thousand nine hundred and seventy three characters left pair no spaces right pair in one comma six seven eight so characters with no spaces Eric is one six seven no eight one thousand right comma six seven eight yeah one thousand six hundred seventy eight so it's nice you get that information with spaces and you get it without spaces words 337 and then your words again <clears throat> so i'm gonna do pc cursor to get back to jaw pc all right so then we're gonna hit escape escape now i'm gonna up arrow Heading level one shortcut keys to and it puts me back in the main document okay so that's how you check your word count character count with jaws 2018 it's also um uh, the same with the jaws uh, that come out after it as well. So let's close JAWS down and let's open up NVDA. JAWS context menu, exit, enter, leaving menu, enter. Shortcut keys, <coughs> dot, dot, work. All right. We're going to give that a second. Let it shut down. All right. So I'm going to do Alt Control N as in November to open up NVDA. All right. Taskbar. You hear it come to the screen. It's a little louder. So let's now make sure. Shortcut. 
Sure. Yep. All right. Our focus is on our document. So now again, I'm going to do a control A just to 2022. All right. You hear it being selected. Heading level one, shortcut keys to align and format. Okay. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to do the same thing. F six. Pain. Status bar, status bar. All right. That's what we're looking for is our status bar. Page number, page one of three hundred <clears throat> current word count 300. Okay. We hear our page number or word count. So this is basically, you know, you're going to see the same thing you did with JAWS. Spelling, word count 337 words. 37 in. words. So here's where it's going to be a little different. Now with JAWS, we had to click on, we pressed enter on this and then had to move to a different cursor. So we had to go to our JAWS cursor and then up air and down air just to see what was there. Now, here we're going to press enter and listen. Word count dialogue statistics colon pages three words 337 characters left for end. No spaces right for n, 1 comma 678 characters left for n, with spaces right for n, 1 comma 973 paragraphs 42 lines 57. Close button. Okay, and we get that same information. This is like a little dialog box. Include text boxes, close button, In close button, include text boxes, comma, footnotes, and end notes, check box, check alt plus F. All right, and what I did there was just up aired. Close button. And it just cycles me from close. Include text box. To include text box. Close button. Include close button. And even when I shift tab, the same thing occurs. We're going to do an insert B's in Bravo. Word count dialog statistics colon. Pages three words, 337 characters left for N. No spaces right for N. One comma 678 characters left for N. All right, so I'm going to stop it there. So we um, get that information again announced to us if we do an insert to B's and Bravo with NVDA. So <clears throat> a little different once you get to this part because of the way it handles this little pop-up that they do or a little screen but um, otherwise it's the same thing. So that's how you check your character count and your word count in Microsoft Word using NVDA and JAWS screen reader. Um, I hope you enjoyed. Uh, if you're new here, please like or subscribe and like if you would, um, and leave a comment. And let me know that you're new here. And uh, if you've been here already, thank you for coming back. And I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you in the next one. Thank you. OBS exam. OBS.